I'm reviewing here the Andrew James Premium Coffee Maker with Integrated Grinder. It's one of the new breed of coffee machines, generally referred to as Bean to Cop. This is available in the UK either through Amazon or directly through Andrew James. What I like about this machine, it's robust. Um, you've got an adjustable grinder here. The setup is very easy, which I'll show you in a moment. Um, you can make anything from two cups to 12 cups. Now, two cups is actually one um, mug of coffee. Uh, that's what I like for myself. It means by doing this it's very consistent. So let's have a look, shall we? When you first get the machine, the only thing you need to do, you do need to run water through it. So fill it up at the back. Take 12 cups of water. They suggest to use the carafe to measure the water in. I'm a little bit sort of uh, confused as to why they want you to measure it because um, like in the mornings I like two cups of coffee and, uh, and so anything as long as it's above four cups in the uh, uh, back reservoir it's got enough for me. Okay, the first thing you do when you get it, turn the power on, uh, it will light up. I won't do it at the moment because it is already set for time. I can change, you just switch it on and change the hour, there's the hour button and the minute. There we go, that's just changed the minute. It's showing the correct time now anyway, so I don't want to disturb it. Alright, now you need to open and put in some uh, coffee beans. This is an airtight container, the coffee needs to be airtight. I'll just put some more in there. Don't put any more than 200 grams in at once. Keep your coffee, once it's open from the, uh, the bags, once it's open from the airtight vacuum bags, keep it in the freezer for consistency. Okay, now we'll put that on there. Let's have a look inside the machine. It opens very easily. comes with its own filter. You can, if you wish, put paper filters in. I can't see the point. It's very easy to clean. Um, make sure that's all set up. You all have your carafe here. It must use a carafe. I did see another brand of one. It will also work without beans. You can use ground coffee. They even supply a measuring spoon if you want to use ground coffee. Or you might want to use some, some ground coffee up that you've already got. Uh, but fresh beans, especially ground beans, are certainly the best. Um, Settings, midway for the grinder, and I've set the strength, which is next. Press that. Oh, that's the cup, sorry. Um, I want two cups, and I've set it at the strongest there, which is three beans. Medium grind, three beans. This is something you need to play around with. This is a button you need to press 
if you want to stop the grinder. Right. It is also fully programmable. I won't go into that and I've got no need for the program. It's I like my coffee really fresh, so I don't want to anticipate the time I'm going to get up. Um, but it could be useful if you could, you know, usually rush off to work fairly quickly. Right. So shall we make a cup of coffee? Three seconds it will take. <laughs> See, but that's only uh, um, two cups, I think, it's not long. It will say it's, it's brewing, so we'll wait for it to brew. Those three beeps tells me that the coffee is complete. warm up to 36 minutes. You can turn it off when you've finished. And uh, just another little tip about this machine. As I said it's very easy to clean. Here we've got the coffee grinds. Just empty them out, rinse it out. And also I would suggest at the end of the day just wipe under here gently with a, a damp um, cloth because there can be some uh, splashes of coffee grinds just up there. Not many but I think it's um, a good idea to make sure everything is clean. And you've got perfect coffee every time. Very well worth the money, £79.99. Uh, it is available in Great Britain and throughout Europe. Um, 